At noon, we got Akron, who started season 0 and 1, traveling to Rutgers, who started season 1 and 0. Rutgers favored by 22 and a half points on the Big Ten Network. Taj Bullock for the Zips went 9 to 13, threw for 68 yards. Just amazing game offensively. I understand you're playing against it's it's against Ohio State. I understand why you didn't have a great game, but he also led his team on the ground with 14 carries for 42 yards. Uh, Jake Newell had two catches for 41 yards. Ethan Cali Manis went 15 to 24, threw for 147 yards, three touchdowns, zero interceptions. Kyle Manonga on the ground had 19 carries for 165 yards and a touchdown. And Dimir Miller had four catches for 37 yards. Just insane day for Dimir Miller. Oh, he also had a touchdown. Uh, at Rutgers is 1 0 against Akron all time. They played in 1990. Um, and they only won 20 to 17 at Rutgers. So it was actually a close game between the Zips and the Scarlet Knights. I don't expect that to be the case today. Akron looked better than everyone thought they would early on against Ohio State. They actually didn't get embarrassed in the first half. And that was big. That was a big win for Akron, right? Um, but Rutgers looked great. Now, to be fair, Rutgers was playing a nobody. They were playing Howard, right? Like this is at least a step up from Howard. But I think in a couple weeks you play a decent Virginia Tech team. I understand they lost to Vanderbilt, but they should be better by that point, right? So I think what's going to be big here, what is going to be really interesting, is these are big tune-up games for Rutgers, right? That's going to be the first game where you're on kind of a national stage, right? People will actually be interested in a Rutgers-Virginia Tech game, maybe. Um, we'll see. I don't think Akron's bad i don't i think they're better than i thought they would be this year it's hard to tell because they played the number two team in the nation um how bad they really are i mean most teams would get their butts kicked by the number two team in the nation clemson got their butts kicked by the number one and clemson's still top 25 so i mean i don't exactly think akron's an awful football team but i just think rutgers is really good i think they if ethan kelly manis can be a decent quarterback if he can take care of the football their defense is solid. Kyle Manonga is a hell of a runner. He's, again, 165 yards and a touchdown in one game. It's going to get way better from there. Kyle Manonga might be the best back in the Big Ten, and he's severely underrated. Um, I think it's going to be a really interesting game to watch, um, just like from a perspective of checking the score and like seeing how Rutgers is going to do. I don't think this is even close to one of the better games of the day. Again, second largest spread of the early window, only being out by Rhode Island, Minnesota by one point. I don't know if Akron's gonna. I don't know anything about Akron as the thing. They looked really bad last year, but football teams can't change, right? Uh, they didn't look awful like early on against Ohio State, but the Ohio State ended up running away. I still think Rutgers is a really good football team, a better football team than Akron. Give me Rutgers to win and cover at home.